new video from me uh, it's been a while and in this video I I was thinking about having like a sit down and just explain why I went MIA uh, why we're not in London <laughs> and everything uh, but I think I would just like explain in between this vlog uh, because I have been shopping you know it's been like January sales and I have I went a bit local, uh, so I want to show you some of the things that I got, so maybe you can get some of it yourself uh, and just like bring you uh, through my day. But now i just gotten ready, uh, I am meeting my mom for a coffee, just a little coffee lunch kind of date today. And then afterwards I have some time to show you the new stuff and uh, talk a bit about what I've been doing lately. So this is my outfit, I have this fringe set on, uh, both of them is from H&M and it is on sale right now. This is a part of the January sales shopping I've been doing uh, and I will link everything down in the description box below so you can find it. This is so so cozy and so chic. And I have some jewelry on, this is from a Bebsi. I will also link it down below. These are like croissant earrings. So beautiful. And I also have the ring that matches the croissant ring. with my mom it was just a quick lunch to catch up a bit because me and my boyfriend we were in Spain last week and uh, just to get like a fresh and warm start uh, to the new year and now I'm back home and uh, I will show you now the new things that I have bought and I will also update you <laughs> on what's been happening the past few months here you can see some of the pieces. This is from Naked. So I will try them on and show you. And we have a lot of new pieces from Amen, which is activewear. The most beautiful activewear, if you ask me. But before we do all of that, uh, I can give like a quick update uh, on what's been going on for the past few months. Uh, because if you have watched my previous videos, uh, you know that we moved to London in like September, August, September last year. So it's been many months now actually. And I did start uh, on making a video about apartment hunting. We were on many apartment showings in London in different areas because we didn't know where we wanted to live. But as you see now, we are in Oslo <laughs> in a completely different apartment. So things have happened. We are now at our first apartment and we are in Notting Hill, which is a very cute location in London uh, where we could possibly see us live, but we don't know. So let's go! So we are in the first apartment in Notting Hill. Here we have the bedroom. It's really modern, but it still has these beautiful details.
it is the next day and we are today looking at two different apartments and you see here behind me that we are in a very colorful street we are still in Notting Hill uh, and these I'm very excited about I really loved yesterday's apartment but it was not furnished and we really want something furnished so these apartments here are furnished <laughs> let's go The main reason why we're not in London uh, is because we couldn't get a visa. We did not know that it was so hard uh, for entrepreneurs, like people with private uh, companies, uh, to get a visa. So after Brexit, basically, they have these new rules, uh, which means that you uh, have to work for an, a British company or yeah, basically have a job in London or be a student in London and stuff like that to get a visa like quickly and that was not our case because both me and my boyfriend we work for ourselves uh, and that means that uh, the process of getting the visa was a lot a lot a lot harder and we didn't know so we actually uh, started to pay like the deposit on an apartment that we really loved and so we gave away a lot of money to get that apartment and then they asked okay can you send over the visa and we were like visa what do you need a visa to live in london like that's never happened before so we we didn't know that we should have we should have done our homework better uh, it's a bit comic that both of us didn't know and nobody told us <laughs> uh, But then we have to say to goodbye to that apartment and we basically decided to instead of Live there. We will just go back and forth for it because my boyfriend is still doing the work that he wanted to do in London That is still going to happen and it is happening uh, But we are gonna live here in Oslo so our little London adventure uh, was very very quick uh, it lasted like basically a month or something and then we were back here again so we had to find a completely new apartment here in Oslo and uh, so we stayed at my parents place for like one to two months and then we moved in here in late October so now we are in Oslo at Majorstuen and we are very happy with that I really like the idea of living in London, but I do love to be in Oslo also. And you know, we have this whole apartment that I haven't shown you, so I will do an apartment tour later, but the apartment is not ready. If you see here, like, what are those? <laughs> that does not look safe. So our apartment is not ready but i will show you just like glimpses of it and you can see some glimpses of it on my instagram already and here you see we are living basically on the floor right now and we have now for some months we are waiting for our bed and look at this giant piece of furniture this is our like you know the thing that you have behind your bed sengegavl that's what it's called in norwegian and just look at this Oh my gosh, 
so so pretty I will show you this later I will wrap it up today even though it will not be ready today Just look at this beautiful thing. How pretty is this? Like seriously. So beautiful. And the bed that I've ordered is completely black, very like minimalistic. So I think that will be a nice match with this one. So this is for a 180 bed. We have a kind of a huge bed. And by the way, <laughs> speaking of the rattan, like the rattan is this, this thingy here. And in two weeks, uh, we are picking up our kitten. Yay! We are picking her up in Sweden, so it will take some hours to get her. Uh, in two weeks, Saturday in two weeks, maybe I will film it, we'll see. But you know, this rattan thing uh, on our bed, uh, that is not cat safe to say it at least. It's kind of stupid actually of us to buy this kind of bed when we know that we're gonna get a kitten in two weeks. But you know, I want that bed and I want that kitten so we'll just see how that works out. And speaking of rattan, you know, we also have these most beautiful chairs in rattan and I know that she will love them as well. I can just see her scratching everything up. So good thing we have this and I think I will maybe have some pillows over there when she's home alone. Just to make it as safe as possible. But you know, now we're gonna, we're gonna start with the clothing try on so you can see what I've been uh, shopping lately. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you is what I was wearing today. So this fringy thing, I bought it from H&M and it's actually on sale now. I did not buy it on sale, so lucky you guys. Uh, you can see it here. It has this fun fringy thing. It's super warm. It is in like this beautiful wool blend. You can check on the website and I will link it down below. You see these beautiful details? very very pretty let's go to the naked haul so then we have these lovely lovely pants they are fake leather pants i don't know what you call it they have the perfect blue color and these pants i really want in more colors i am not a pants person i uh, i own two pair of jeans i'm not kidding two pair of jeans so i need some new pants uh, but I prefer like textile, like more soft pants, something like this. So next up is this uh, sweater, jumper, I don't know what you call it, in this very nice like neutral color. And this is also something that I need in my wardrobe. I don't have a lot of these basic pieces because I've always been this statement, maximalism person. Uh, my style, my fashion has changed a lot the past three years. So these are something that I need in my wardrobe. And these are very soft. You see they have this ribbed, ribbed effect. Love it. I'm definitely gonna keep this. To find pieces like this on sale, that is just great because that things you need in your wardrobe. So why pay full price when you then can get them on sale? So this has this beautiful neutral neutral color. I don't know what I think about the colors. Like I am looking uh, for more neutral colors, but maybe this is not for me. Hmm, no. I think it's a bit too masculine for me. Like I need it to be more feminine, but I do love it. I really love it, but maybe not on me. So when I have these very masculine oversized kind of blazers, I need them to be in white or pink or purple, just to have this feminine touch on it. But then we have another blazer and this one, oh, look at the color, is so neutral. Ah, you see there. Oh, but it's a bit small. Like I can, I can barely like, a move in this? Oh no! 
It was so pretty though. Look at that hourglass. Very, very beautiful. So maybe I will return it and get it in another size. But also like the colors are beautiful, but I don't know if they are for me because I am more of a pink, purple, blue kind of person. And that makes me pop more. And then the final piece from Naked is this dress that I have been obsessed with since I last bought it because i did order this if you follow me on instagram you can see it in one of my reels i bought it in green and in white but the last time i received it it has this foundation around the neck uh, which i didn't want uh, but i really want it in more colors because i just think the fit is so beautiful with the belt here it's just so flattering so i am definitely keeping this one and actually, I do not remember if this, especially this dress, is on sale. But I will link it down below, so you can check anyways. Now we're on to the Amen, the workout wear. And I am wearing one of the sets now, because I am going to Barry's Bootcamp today with a girlfriend. And I want to show you, I'm not going to try all these on, I will just show them to you. But this ribbed, this ribbed thing is just so, so nice. You see they have these like shaping details. You see this thing here? Uh, and I have been wearing Amen for many years. I am such a fan. I remember they were famous for these. Let me show you a photo here. I bet you have seen these. That's how it started. Maybe 10 years ago, I don't remember. Um, very colorful, very splashy, flashy. <laughs> and now we're here in 2023 with this neutral, very chic activewear. So things change. We have this beautiful color here. I think the color, yeah, sandwiched is the color. So this is uh, the seamless activewear. This is the looks seamless, so this has a bit more details, which this one is just the classic ribbed one. And I decided to actually go for a, a full arm length on the top. Perfect now for winter. It's all on sale. Uh, this looks the same that I'm wearing now, but in the shorts. So the shorter ver version, it has this heart shaped here, which is making it very flattering on your body. It has these seams here. Yeah, just really, really nice. From before, I have the gray one in tights and top. So I decided to order the long top now, instead of just the short bra. So then I can mix it up a bit. And then we have the last one, this beautiful green shimmery color it also has the heart shaping it's just so stunning just look at the details with the seams here so so beautiful i cannot wait to wear these i actually think i want to change to the green one for barry's today i just really fell for it but i think i have ordered the top in uh, in a bigger size than usual. I'm supposed to have a small, but this is a medium. But let's try it on. Maybe they're very small in size. I have actually changed to one of my other workout sets. So I want to show you. Here you see the other set. It's really nice with this detailing you see here. It's shaping really nicely. So you see the color, the details. Would recommend to check out their sale now when they have their winter sale. Maybe it's even done when I post this video. I hope not. But guys, how cute is this cat tree? How fashionable and cute and fluffy is this? I do not want our apartment to <laughs> to be like a only like a cat home. When you get into the apartment, you just see cat things everywhere, but I guess that's how it's gonna be. And I have bought this, <laughs> this little scratch ball. <laughs> how cute is it? It's super cute. 
<laughs> and if you have a cat, look at that. I think it's so creepy, but I know that she will love it. You see, it can even, it has these sensors so that it can go everywhere. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I cannot wait to pick her up and I will, of course, introduce you guys to her later. But I think I will end this video here. You have a small update on where I've been and I hope I'll see you soon. I'm gonna see what I can do with the uh, filming and stuff, uh, but I sure want to show you some parts of the uh, apartment when it's done. So I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next time. Ciao!